Hi there Sagittarius, here to get you some tarot messages for today. Let's look into the energies of your person. We'll see what's going on with your person. What do the cards have to say today? We have Ten of Sword, Ace of Cups, Lovers, Sun, Eight of Wands, Devil, Five of Wands, Knight of Coins. All right, so your person is feeling very capable of making change right now. Um, they're putting efforts in here. They're putting in the effort. They know what they want now. They're making change. They're taking an action. Uh, they see the value of their relationship with you. Um, and they're, they're not going to worry about it anymore. They're putting an end to that. This Ten of Swords is like they're done. Done, done, done. Done with the craziness. Done with where they were. They need to be with you in the sunshine here. Um, you know, sharing that cup of love here. Uh, they're definitely taking an action here. They're focused. Uh, they're releasing something. Um, that tethered them. You know, if you look at this devil card, they're, they're tied, they're tethered. Um, however, they are capable of removing um, the tethers, you know, and it, it's, it's a choice. Uh, there's choices being made here, and they're choosing to release themselves um, from a um, a tethered situation. They're they're cutting the cords, is what I'm getting here. Five of cups. They they've been in like um. A depressive state or um, feeling like they couldn't change or um, something really weighed them down they they um, they're a little bit depressed here or feeling like things are not right um, and they know they need to you know they turn around you know there's a, there's a turning point here when the, this um, Five of Cups here is, you know, his head's down. He's feeling badly. He's looking at, you know, what the, the opportunities that he's missed. However, there's a turning point. If he turns around, he'll see those two cups there. There is love here. There's love to be had. All is not lost. I feel like your person felt um, chained to something um, that kept them from you. But they're realizing that they can release the chains. They can um, remove that collar that kept them bound. They can um, cut the ties that bound them. Yeah, it's like the end of that situation, the world. It's like, all right, we're done with that. We're, we're, we're ready for this change. Um, we're going to move on. We're going to take an action. I mean, look at these fives. You've got five of cups, five of swords, five of wands, all about change, all about change. And change is not easy, but your person's stepping up because they know they need to take an action. They cannot live any longer where they are. They cannot live any longer without you. They're taking steps. They're setting goals. They want to be with you, and they will successfully reach their goal. No doubt about it. They know things have to change. They know they have to end the way it was. And Feel it. You know, there's a feeling here. Ten of Swords is thinking, you know, overthinking things. But letting that go now with the King of Pentacles. King of Pentacles wants for nothing. He has everything he needs. Um, and the only thing he needs right now is you. Ace of Cups, lover, son. He wants to ride off into the sunset with you. He does have to heal um, this change that he's made, though, first. He's he's made a change. He's uh, cut a tie. But he does need to heal from that before he can actually, you know... Um, Speak his truth or or um, take an action towards you or tell you what's going on here. Lovers, it's like your connection is real. You belong together. You complement each other. I feel like it's time to ride off into the sunset together. Uh, but things have to change here. And it, your person is making the changes. There is a turning point. There is an end to an old situation. They're stepping up. They're going to fight for you here. They're going to fight their way out of a situation. They're going to cut the ties that bound them or kept them away from you because it did not feel good. Wherever they were did not feel good. Either they overthought things or were they stuck in something that kept them from you. They're getting out of that. This is a turning point. They want to ride off into the sunset with you. And boy, they're struggling to get there. Five of Wands again. So Five of Wands here twice. It's like they feel like 
maybe they're learning to some self-confidence here because they that they didn't have before they're gaining that self-confidence um because you know ten of swords like negative thinking like thinking all oh, is gonna fall apart and it's the end of the world yet the king of pentacles is like has everything Four of Swords knows how to heal. Ace of Cups is like a new, uh, a seed of this love, you know, that just that little seed of love. Like, they, isn't there something about a mustard seed? Isn't there a tale about the mustard seed? Mustard seed is very, very small, but yet, you know, it, it there's, there's growth here. Uh, so there's like this spark that's inspiring your person to transform their life, make radical changes. Um, and changes are not easy, but it's time for this. I feel like they resisted this and resisted it and resisted it. It was like a monkey on their back. Now they said, get off my back, monkey. I'm going for my love is what I'm hearing. All right. Let us close with um, Earth Warrior Oracle today. I'll read that in closing. Number 25 is Aloha Keakua, Blessings of the Supreme Being. Aloha Keakua, the divine is love. The supreme being from which all life emanates manifests a blessing for you. The realm of the heart is love's temple. When you enter the heart, you gain access to the great one and to the mana, the power, authority, grace, and magnetism to manifest your divine destiny. Trust in what is meant for you. Surrender doubt and disconnection in favor of love and respect for the great one. And you shall live your true destiny with joy in your heart. Love can and will conquer all. Peace be with you. Bye now.